possible causes of long periods. If the due date has passed and the menstruation has not ended, this is an occasion to think about your health and see a doctor. Indeed, behind this seemingly harmless problem, serious diseases can be hidden. Menstruation for a woman is always a source of various experiences and worries. Delayed or started earlier than expected, did not go as usual, and so on. But perhaps the most worrying thing is when menstruation lasts longer than expected. What determines the duration of menstruation? A woman's menstrual cycle is completely dependent on her hormonal status. The determining role is played by both sex hormones and hormones of the thyroid gland and adrenal glands. Depending on their concentration and ratio at each point in time, both the duration and the nature of menstruation depend. Normally, the duration of menstruation is 3 to 7 days, but if it exceeds this value, then you should consult a doctor, and the sooner the better. The fact is that the cause of prolonged menstruation can be a variety of factors, ranging from stress and hormonal failure to serious diseases of the pelvic organs. Possible causes of long periods The menstrual cycle is determined by the level of hormones, but a variety of factors can influence their production. Most often, prolonged menstruation is due to the following problems. Unidentified hormonal background. Prolonged menstruation can be in girls during puberty, in women during the menopausal transition. Hormonal disorders. Prolonged menstruation may be the result of disturbances in the hormonal system. They are caused by a variety of factors, such as stress, overexertion, malnutrition, rapid weight gain, chronic diseases such as diabetes and obesity, and many others. Long-term use of certain medications can also negatively affect the menstrual cycle. Diseases of the endocrine system Some diseases of the endocrine glands, primarily the thyroid gland and adrenal glands, can lead to a violation of the cycle. Diseases of the ovaries Many ovarian diseases affect the regularity of the menstrual cycle. It can be either acute or chronic inflammation of the appendages, or ovarian neoplasms like cysts and tumors, and many other problems. Diseases of the uterus Prolonged menstruation can be caused by certain diseases and formations in the uterus, for example, uterine endometriosis, fibroids, polyps and endometrial hyperplasia, and malignant tumors can occur. Of the acute inflammatory diseases, endometritis is most often diagnosed. Use of an intrauterine device Sometimes some women who have an intrauterine device installed note that their periods have become longer, and there may also be prolonged spotting after menstruation. Hormonal preparations In some cases, the use of hormonal drugs can also lead to changes in the menstrual cycle. Violation in the blood coagulation system Sometimes menstruation does not end due to a sharp drop in blood clotting factors. Of course, the list does not end there, but the reasons presented in it are the most likely. Other reasons Prolonged bleeding due to delayed menstruation. This may be a sign of threatened miscarriage. It is also necessary to exclude an ectopic pregnancy, as this can threaten the life of a woman. Consequences of abortion After medical termination of pregnancy, spotting can last up to two to three weeks. This is not menstruation, but rather bleeding associated with changes in hormonal levels and rejection of the endometrium. Somewhat less bleeding may last after surgical or vacuum interruption. All situations in which menstruation lasts more than seven days or this menstruation came profusely and for a long time after a delay require immediate medical attention and urgent measures to stop bleeding. What to do with prolonged menstruation? If the menstruation does not end on the 7-8th day, the first thing to do is to contact a gynecologist. This is the best thing you can do in such a situation, any independent action can only do harm. An even greater threat is the situation when menstruation is not only long, but also plentiful. Normally, during menstruation, a woman loses about 80 milliliters of blood. With heavy menstruation, a woman notes large blood clots, Every two hours it is necessary to change the pad of the maximum volume or tampon, change hygiene products at night. Abundant blood loss is accompanied by a breakdown, skin poverty, perspiration, 
pain in the lower abdomen. In this case, you should immediately consult a doctor for an appointment or call an ambulance, no matter what time of day this happens. Examination for prolonged menstruation. If a woman goes to the doctor with complaints of prolonged menstruation, then first of all she will need to undergo a basic examination. Gynecological examination. The doctor will examine the genitals and also determine the nature of the discharge. Ultrasound. With its help, you can study the structure of the internal genital organs, determine the presence of changes in the uterus and ovaries. Determination of the hormonal profile. An important indicator is the level of certain hormones, FSH, LG, estradiol, prolactin, thyroid hormones, adrenal hormones. Determination of the number of platelets and indicators of the blood coagulation system. It is imperative to check the level of hemoglobin and ferritin to rule out anemia and iron deficiency. If an inflammatory process is suspected, it may be necessary to be tested for latent infections. Based on the results of the examination, the doctor will be able to determine the cause of the menstrual irregularity and select the necessary treatment.